and this week I want us to think about destiny well I'm sure you have heard this word once and again and uh, you wonder what does it mean do you have a destiny what destiny is well just to simplify is where you're going is your destination is your future is uh, is where you want to be in a few years from now and uh, I'm reminded and I went the other day to the police station that I uh, I served for a number of years five years and uh, I looked at it and nothing much has changed and I went to the house that I lived in and uh, it's a one room house 10 by 10 no plaster no good floor no ceiling no electricity and uh, when I was there well life was tough yes but um, what helped me if I can mention a few things is that uh, is the power to endure because when you realize where you are today is not where you will be tomorrow then you endure today because tomorrow will come don't give up today because you do not know what the day will bring forth so I endured you know no power no water you had to walk quite a distance to take a shower and uh, it was tough but I endured because I knew this is only for a moment and I want to say to you it's good you endure where you are today tomorrow is gonna be better and the other thing is that you never underestimate the power of vision when I was there and with all those struggles and a salary of 2200 I knew this is not all there is in life I knew one day one month one year one season time to come things will change for the better and therefore i kept my vision alive i had a vision to succeed i had seen people who succeeded i had seen people who failed and i hated to fail you know growing up with poverty luck didn't even have enough food i remember in high school we didn't have enough food and I won a pair of shoes when I went to high school and so I hated poverty with a passion but I decided well I'm going to fight this thing called poverty and I need a vision I need a strategy I need to do all that I can I need to be diligent work hard and when I resigned from the police I went to the to the combat market and sold secondhand clothes and uh, had a barber shop and I tried anything, you know, Bible covers and all small, small things that I could do. Why? Because I decided I have a dream, I have a vision. I cannot give up on my dream because I have a destiny. I have a place that I'm going to and I'm not going to quit. And then prepare for where you're going. Well, most of us get into trouble because you're only thinking about today and where you are and the troubles of the day but it's so important that you prepare for where you are going don't just think about today and that's the end of life there is tomorrow there is next week there is five ten years from now so prepare for where you're going mentally physically if you need to study, if you need to be more diligent, you may need to put more hours, if you need to, you know, uh, look for help from people who can give you wisdom, you know, all that you need to prepare, you know, read books that are aligned to your vision and your destiny. Don't just read everything. How do you manage your time? What do you do every day? What are the small things you do? Because they are the ones that will amount to the big thing. So, what I'm saying is that you have a great destiny, but it may not seem like today. You may be struggling today. You may be even, well, they always talk, you can't make ends meet. Well, I want to say to you, be encouraged. All of us have been there one way or another, but we have been fighting and we are still fighting because life is about fighting for your destiny, for where you're going. And I want to say and assure you, you will succeed no matter what. Keep that alive, keep your dream alive, keep saying I will succeed. 
I will overcome poverty, lack. Today may be a jobless, but you will not always be jobless. Maybe you don't have a business. You will come up with one from nothing. I started with a loan of 12000 that I was paying. I had spent the money, but I actually started from negative 12000 But, well, it's not over until you win. So have a great week and uh, fight to win. And you will succeed no matter what. Have a good one.